Hello family in Figyan. Welcome each and every one of you. A very, very happy and prosperous new year 2024. So let's kick off the first video of the year with excitement and positivity. Our first problem is we have to simplify the expression. Second problem is we have to simplify the expression. So this video is for expression simplification. Let's get started by first problem. 2024 cube minus 2023 cube minus 1 over 2024 times 2023. So I will solve this problem. If you are thinking that a cube minus b cube is on, then you can go ahead and just check. It is not going to solve easily. What I am going to consider, I will write this 1. You can see it is 1. This one we are thinking that it should be one can be written as 2024 minus 2023. Now again it won't work. So whole cube let us try. So I will write our expression 2024 whole cube minus 2023 whole cube minus 2024 minus 2023. This is our one and whole cube I am taking divided by denominator. So I am writing only numerator. At last we will take up denominator also. Okay. Now we know one identity a minus b whole cube which is a cube minus b cube minus 3a square b plus 3ab square. Let's apply over here. So I can write numerator is equal to 2024 whole cube minus 2023 cube. Then I will apply the formula. So I will write 2024 whole cube minus 2023 whole cube minus 3a square. So in place of a we are having 2024 b so i will write 2023 then plus i need to write and then i will write 2024 times 2023 whole square this is our numerator now you can easily see once i will write this and expand the bracket so 2024 whole cube will be over as this minus sign is there then 2023 whole cube will be over so what is left, let me write one time, 3 times 2024 whole cube times 2023. Then I will write minus, minus times plus, so minus 3 times 2024 times 2023 whole square. Now I can see 3 times 2024 times 2023 is common. Once I will take this term common, so in first place what we will be having 2024. In second term's place I will get 2023. Now it would be 1. So our ultimate numerator is 3 times 2024, 2024 times 2023. Now let us find out our n over d value. So what I will write n over d it would be equal to 3 times 2024 times 2023 over 2024 times 2023. So our first answer is 3 means the answer for first question. Now first answer. So here in this place we will write answer is 3. Now let us take the second simplification problem and I will solve this problem by two different method. One is common which is sum of finite gp and second method we will use factorization. So let us solve using factorization first. Let me consider root 5 is equal to a. So our expression is 1 plus a plus a square. Let me expand a cube 
a power 4 plus a power 5 plus a power 6 plus a power 7 plus a power 8 dot 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 and last three term a power 2022 plus a power 2023 plus a power 2024 again i will consider this is my numerator so i am writing only numerator okay what i am trying to show you that is how we can consider factorization so from first three term i will write as it is this term as it is unchanged 1 plus a plus a square then i will take the next three term i can see a cube is common so i will write a cube common 1 plus a plus a square again same bracket is coming out in next three terms i can see a power 6 is common so 1 plus a plus a square again same thing is common dot 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 and then for the last three terms similar way i will take 2022 common out so 1 plus a plus a square will be there so you can see bracket is there I will take this complete bracket common so which will give us 1 plus a plus a square and in bracket I will write the remaining left terms 1 from the first term a cube from the second term from here a power 6 from the third term a power 22 from the last term so I will write 2022 and if you will see only your denominator it is same bracket so let me write now n over d the expression so i can write 1 plus a plus a square times 1 plus a cube plus a power 6 up to a power 2022 over same denominator 1 plus a plus 1 plus a cube plus a 6 and last term you can see it is same as 2022 now you will cancel this complete bracket from numerator and denominator so your answer is in terms of a our answer is 1 plus a plus a square in terms of given problem because a we have presumed it is root 5 so i can write here 1 plus root 5 plus root 5 a square so it will give us final answer 6 plus a square root 5 i hope this factorization method you like it second way of solving that is our conventional method so let me write second method conventional why i am saying because finite gp sum is on so let me write first if a plus ar plus ar square up to ar raised to the power n number of terms then sum would be a times r power n minus 1 over r minus 1 where mod r is greater than 1 this is what we know so we will apply the same so let me consider root 5 is equal to r here so it is nothing but 1 plus r plus r square and last term is r raised to the power 2024 divided by 1 plus r cube plus r power 6 up to last term is r raised to the power 2022 now we will write the sum formula for numerator and denominator separately let me write this sum formula for numerator first okay so you can see first term is 1 so i will write this formula 1 what is common ratio r so i will write r how many terms are there 1 2 3 4 2 2024 so there is 2024 plus this extra one so 2025 minus 1 divided by r minus 1 so r minus 1 i will write come to the complete division 
now i will write denominator first term is 1 okay in bracket common ratio is r cube this time whole power the number of terms how many terms are there so we have to find out how it would be 2022 divided by 3 so if you will divide this this value is 674 now this extra term or one you can consider is there so we will consider one more term so 675 so let me write here 675 terms are there 369 up to 2022 674 terms and first term that is r power 0 or 1 that is one extra term so 675 minus 1 over r minus 1 and here r is common ratio is r cube okay now using exponent property what we will write we can write a raised to the power b whole power c we can write any time a power b c so we will multiply these written two numbers so it will give us r power 2025 minus 1 divided by r minus 1 and then we will take the product that would be 2025 again minus 1 over r q minus 1 so i will write like this the denominator's denominator is numerator now you can see we can cancel these two terms so what is left r q minus 1 over r minus 1 now we will apply a q minus b q a minus b a square plus a b plus b square over r minus 1 again i will cancel r minus 1 with r minus 1 so what is left r square plus r plus 1 same result so i will write r square plus r plus 1 let's put the value of r r we have considered earlier root 5 so root 5 is square plus root 5 plus 1 6 plus square root 5 there are plenty of methods more than four or five methods are still there if you want to solve share that solution you can share with me thank you so much for watching do not forget to like share subscribe bye bye good luck and once again happy new year to each and every one